from Clark Crocs and for today is another episode of this Minecraft vanilla with a twist and as you can see in my hot bar I have been butchering some sheep and cows in here because the farms that the farm that we built in the previous video was not working as efficient as I thought it would be so I need to but I need to butcher some some cows and just one sheep if you don't mind so yep so I'm thinking for this episode we would um, explore, explore, um, geez, how could I speak again? We would explore, uh, okay, never mind. We just, we would go to the mine shelf that I think was in there, in the, in our hidey hole. And is this finally cooking? And I just figured out that there are two furnaces now in Minecraft. A blast furnace and I forget about the other furnace. Um, let me check about that. Where should that be? Um, this is the blast furnace and this is a smoker. So I think this two can cook food. I'm not quite sure but I see this is a blast furnace. So, yep. Hmm. I'm kind of wanna... Wait, I have here a log, right? Um, yep. I think I'm gonna made some of that and figure out what is the purpose of that um, smoker. So we got here... The fern fern that I think that I could use, but definitely not. So um, let's build. Just wait. You could do it with with ni what? You could do it neither without any strip logs. Okay. Now let's place the smoker. Um. Okay. Now that's cooking, and I think it's getting night time. But let me check this. Oh, so it's still the same, huh? And by the way, guys, I I and I know what's the use of smoker. It is used for the um, villagers to. Um, I forget about the thing, the exact name for it, but um, it's used to specify their trading. And I think you could cook in here also. So let me just try that. Let me take the um. Let me just take half of that coal. Oh. I have taken way too much than I thought it, it would be. So let's place the smoker in there and what's go what's it gonna be? Oh! So it's just like a furnace. But it's kinda more like a dropper than a furnace and... Hmm. Okay, so that's just what it does. Wait, can I cook this in here? Oh, you can't. Okay. Oh, by the way guys, um, I have... Re-expro- uh, re -exp uh, I'm not gonna say that word again. I went to the, the, the strip mine that we have in the... I think it was the episode 1. And I have found some more irons in the place that we have found the rough diamond. And I'm... And I haven't get that still. But I think... Let me get that. It was all in here. As you can see in there, we got some more iron in there. And I think there's an yep, there's an iron in here, and I'm gonna be a little bit careful because I'm pretty sure that there is a lava right in here. And oh no, this part can spawn mobs that I don't want to spawn, and I freaking just hit the wrong button. Okay, there you go. And I think I'm just gonna take off all of this gravel and figure out what is more in here because I think this can help us to find I think oh there is the lava in there I think this could help us to find more diamonds hopefully okay so guys we just recently come back from the um, the strip mine over there and as you can see we got only 10 10 irons and I found out that there there's um and and redstone ore in there too but I didn't get a chance to get it because our because I don't bring my iron pickaxe and also the shop also the stone shovel break and it's not yet night okay this isn't gonna be a little bit terrifying for me but okay so 
Wait, is the smoker still burning? Nope. Okay, let's just put this in here. Um, here. So just for this video, I think we would explore, explore, um, uh, jeez, I'm not gonna say that word again. Please remember, please tell me that, don't say that word again. Okay. So, we're gonna go in the mineshaft for the day, I think, and I think we can craft some more tools, so hopefully our iron, our gears are enough, so, um, let me oh why do they what do why do i click that so i did just um wait where do where did i put the thing oh so we just got a bucket and i freaking forgot that we had another bucket in here but oh well let's just do that so i think we're geared up wait i need the pickaxe i think that's this the pickaxe that we would bring right now because i think we have a decent amount of um um, what is it? Iron for now. So let's exp exp ah, uh, jeez. I just said it that I I just said that I won't say it again, but I freaking said it again. So let's just go to the mine shaft. So okay, guys, are we ready now or not? Wait. So um, I think I'm ready. So let's eat this ready mutton. You get that ready mutton? Okay. How could I freaking break this? Um, I'm f I'm pretty still scared. There are any mobs that would spawn in here? Like I don't want to fight any creeper. So please, 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 please. Okay. Please don't. So okay, guys, we just trap ourselves in here from there, and let's check out what's inside. Oh, so oh, a name tag. So that's nice. And we got ourselves ten rails. And um, three beetroots, pumpkin seeds. Wait, we got four pumpkin seeds. That's good for the farm. Melon seeds. I forgot that this is melon seeds. And we got ourselves a torch and a bread. So that's pretty nice. We got ourselves a food also. So I think let me just take you also and and let me take this. There we go. Thank you. Um, so I pretty much just have block this side accidentally by placing a block so okay but um this goal is pretty nice so i'm gonna take this okay so here is another part of the mine shaft and i'm pretty scared please shucks let's run oh she she Alright guys, I just realized that the mineshaft goes further more than that while I'm editing this video because I have just blocked it out with a gravel so maybe in some point of time we would go in there again but right for this time let's do the next clip. So okay guys, I think we can scrap the plan that we would need to go to a mineshaft right now because that mineshaft I think is a pretty small mineshaft. Like the only thing that we got in that is... 11 rails, a mine cart, um, a name tag which is which is pretty good, and two breads, and okay. And by the way, the seeds that we we have we got, I have now planted them in the farm. So now I was thinking because the plan for this video was was a scrap, I was thinking maybe we could exp explore. Ex ah, okay, I'm not gonna say it again, please. And we would go in this side and figure out what is furthermore in here. And by the way, if you don't know, the... Wait, I can hear a spider. By the way, if you don't know, the um, the wandering trailer that we had in here, the spawn, like seriously, like I haven't got his llama and by the way that other llama in here was the was from another traveling trader which spawned right there oh. hmm what is this oh we have a cave in here i didn't i did not notice that hopefully there's a witch shot in here somewhere because i need a witch farm 
Mm, and I think is uh, there is a bet. And I need a time form. So hopefully. Uh, wow. Now this is a site to make another empire or another village I think. That's cool but would I risk crossing this lake? Because I'm not pretty sure if there is a drown in here. Um, hmm, I think that's not a swamp anymore in there. Yo! Yo guys! This is an incredible sight. Hmm... I think... I would change the location of the mine that I was planning to do. To, to put it in here or... Oh! Maybe in there somewhere. But I think it's time for us to go back to the house. It's, it's getting... Oh, there's another pineapple. What? You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. I'm so... So gonna get killed if I go too crazy with this pineapple thing. So I just not gonna mind any of you pineapples. So guys, I'm just strip mining in here and as you can see, we know this cave, right? This is the cave that was connected in here and I blocked some parts in here just to keep us safe. And you know what I've found? I think there is a spawner right around here in this side. And by the way, I got some resources. So I got a two stacks of redstone and just 10 pieces of iron like geez we are still lacking of iron but i'm pretty sure right over there right that side is a spawner and i wanna figure out if my hunch is correct so um i think i should mine in here um let me see so by the way i still haven't gone up to there so maybe in some point i would go up in here but let me check that first if Wait. Okay. So I just realized that this part, this side here is connected to our strip mine. So my hunch is definitely wrong. So, yep. And I'm pretty much scared in there. So I'm just gonna block that out. Oh snap! This is not what I was expecting guys. This is a huge cave and I am not gonna go much more further than this. Nope, I'm not gonna go in there. This is this is way too extreme for me. Hmm. I don't know what should I do in this video because our plan has been scrapped, so um wait, do we have the right blocks? Hmm, so I was thinking maybe because I really won't need a spawner or an XP farm. I think we would just mm, made a, um, what is this? A mob farm. Yep, a mob, a mob farm. Okay. Oh, oh, it's raining. So I'm just figuring out where we should build the, um, the mob farm, which I think in here because this is a pretty good place and we use all of the iron that we had from that mine exhibition to just to just to craft this thing so hopefully this is something good supposed to be so don't let me down so okay guys here is the progress that i have been going on since we placed the chest and the um the um the hopper and this is not the prettiest thing that I could ever done in Minecraft, but we need to stick with this because definitely we are lacking in some items. And by the way, I, I craft some ladders for us to help in climbing. And hopefully, we can climb right now. Come on. Uh, what the heck? There we go. And might as well break this bed. So, I'm just gonna continue in here again. Hopefully, um, I don't know. Um, to be honest, guys, I don't know the height 
that I should go in here. So I think I'm just gonna um, I'm just gonna go to the height which I could kill myself in there. So let's go. Okay, here is the test now, guys. Hopefully, this is the right height. And oh, yep, it's the right height. So, guys, this is the progress that I have been doing right now. So, as you can see, we got this into a into a cobblestone platform, and I have luck. Um, I have no furthermore cobblestone, so I need to use something that we have down here. Could you nope? Ah, geez, so I'm just thinking I should stop this for a little bit. There we go, and hopefully I could go down. Hopefully I could go down. Thank you. Come on. And I think mobs are gonna spawn in here in any moment, but so I'm gonna I'm just gonna light this out. And I know there's a zombie in here, so I think that guy would turn to drown in at any moment. But we need to light this all place down. As you can see, that is... Oh, I forgot to place one block there. Okay. This is pretty huge. It almost goes to our house. And by the way, guys. Um, some crazy sh from some crazy shenanigans have been happening. Ah! Get out! Jeez! I forget that there's a block that could... Help this zombie climb in here like this block and that creeped me out. Whew. And some crazy thing some crazy things had been happening in here like I have killed one of this one of the llama in here and I have saw an invisible trading villager and this thing is dark also. Okay. And a lot of villagers come in here to fight me and they have not yet survived so i'm hoping that there are no any raids that would come so hopefully this thing could help th with that also and by the way our farm in here is growing and by the way i have not harvest anything just yet again except for the potatoes when i'm um mining in this so we got here a cobblestone cobblestone farm which i used to made that and by the way this entire tower here is made out of gravel so i made this with gravel and cobblestone so i was thinking how to use just re recycled blocks but i kind of want to figure out that if i can build a cobblestone um farm um yep farm we could make this a little bit good so yep and by the way this took me like forever i think it's almost um oh there are four blocks in here okay that four stacks of blocks that could still help this thing took me about um two hours or three hours uh, to just mining um just mining a chest until here i think and i have failed two attempts with this thing like as you can see there are two obsidians in here and by the way the iron that we got is now down to two because i have made four four hoppers one there and two there so i extend it with two by two the down in there um the fall um wait i don't know how to say it but the hole in there which we could strike down and um did i say that metal rates had come in here so as you um let's just go into this chest as you can see we have fought i think that's two raids or two illagers and I am freaking want to stop that, and um, I freaking want to stop that because I don't want to sp um, be spawning in here any of the um I forget about the mob that was a huge mob, but um that was um with the illager, I think it's the ravager, ravenger, I think, and I freaking don't want to fight that because that could literally kill me in two blows. With just um the ram and I know I could block it with with our shield but but as you can see our shield is in um um uh, um in half a break so yep so guys I am not I am unfortunately not able to finish this for this video but trust me I would finish this in the um in off screen and maybe in the next video we could get a 
we could get this farm going on but guys that's all the time that i get for this video so don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and um hopefully next time we could um figure out more of the caves in there because that cave is pretty huge but guys that's it for me for this video oh i just thought that i saw a zombie in here somewhere okay so guys that is, that's it for this video don't forget to leave a like don't forget to leave a like or subscribe and that's it for me. Jane.